pretty bad. We hate it. I mean, honestly, we're so glad you asked, so we can finally break the news. If anybody's whoever's writing this, we hate each other. We're like, why this relationship? Whenever you see on the page, it's like Andrew and everyone. If you see this, it's new. No, scene partner, something, anything. We always are on. Contractually, you have to be. Yeah. As soon as the off-camera stuff is, you know, you're out. Goodbye. Hello, hotel. Goodbye, set. <laughs> Welcome to London, Shahar and Noah. It's great to be with you to talk about the shows in season four. Yes. Oh, thank you for having us. How have you found London so far? I love London. Yeah, good. This is one of my favorite cities in the world. Nice. I, I studied abroad here. Oh, cool. I just like every time I come back, I, I have a, a thrilling time. Nice. What about you, Shahar? Yes, yeah, same. It's like a homecoming to come back to London. I also like a school. I did. Uh, Part of drama school here and uh, worked here, so it was. It's always like a third home, and nice to come back. And I feel very comfortable here. Very, yeah. Well, in season four of The Chosen, there's a lot of storylines which I think all of the viewers are excited to see evolve and grow. But for both of your characters, there's been so much maturity from season one through to season three. Can you share with us what we can expect in season four for Andrew and Simon Peter? Yeah, I mean, just that. Honestly, it's about. Um, growing up and maturing and and try to uh, trying to live out the teachings of Jesus um, truthfully and honestly and bring that into our lives and you see the disciples uh, struggle with that some more than others but I think for me personally it is it was as Andrew um, about just trying to follow you know John the Baptist's advice down in Herod's dungeon saying you have a new rabbi now focus on him focus on his teachings and uh, Andrew's doing his best to do that. Yeah, the way it's the way the season starts, it's immediately starts kind of uh, you know everything is shifting pretty rapidly, and then suddenly my position has changed in the group, you know, that's a pretty you know it's a whoa, suddenly people treat me differently, look at me differently, suddenly my responsibilities are expanding. And that's uh, that's something that yeah, it's it's just, it's it's incredible how you know the the people that the way they look at you can really be can really influence you you know so you suddenly see them coming looking for you wanting to wanting you to help resolve and that kind of makes you okay you have to yeah you have to whether you're ready or not you take, put on the mantle and you you know you're there for them. Um, and that expands from what we saw last night. You were there yeah. for the yeah. So it's uh, you know from what we saw, it expands. You know it it goes it goes even deeper. And and so uh, my people, my group, has some moments of need, and this time I can just be there for them. And that's a pretty it's a pretty unique moment for mm -hmm. for this character. Definitely. And you play brothers in the series. What's that yeah. been like playing brothers? Pretty bad. We hate it. We I mean, hit, honestly, we we're stories. so glad you asked, <laughs> so we can yeah. finally break the yeah. news. If anybody's whoever's writing it. this, yeah. we hate stuff. each other. We're like, this why relationship? Whenever you see on Kat, the page, Kat, it's like Andrew everyone, and Simon, if you see wife. this, no. it's new. No, scene not partner, again, something, dude. anything, yeah. anyone it's else. Just, it's just not working. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's not working. I get it. Awkward. You know? Yeah. But it's probably the worst scenes are the ones you have to play together. Totally much. At least to be in. Hopefully, to watch, you can get something out of it. Yeah, it's awkward Whoa. silences in yeah, between. It yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. There's no, no, a lot no, of no, clearing no, of no, throats. No, no. Yeah. They know to put our dressing rooms as further away from each right. other as possible, so we yeah. don't even come. Actually, come only here. one of us is ever in the state at a time. Like yeah. he's in Texas, but yeah. I'm filming in Utah. Yeah, we always are on. Yeah. Different Contractually, sort of groups. you have to be. Yeah. As soon as yeah. the off-camera yeah. stuff yeah. is, you know, you're out. Goodbye. Forget about it. You know, hello hotel, goodbye set. Well, let me ask you this question then. If you weren't playing your character, let's put Andrew and Simon Peter aside. Uh -huh. What other character do you resonate with or the storyline really speaks to you the most? Good question. Do you know? In the show, huh? Yeah, yeah not in Game of Thrones. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's, let's focus on The Chosen. Let's Game stay with The Chosen. Oh, The yeah. Chosen. Yeah. Um, no, I, wow, I do. I think, um, honestly, I feel like the character of Shmuel, mm, I think good, yeah. I would have a lot of fun bringing that to life because mm. because you're on the outside of yeah. the group and you're trying to sort of poke holes. And I have a little bit of that within myself that 
wanting to question and analyze and that intellectual energy that I think I would have a lot of fun bringing to life. Yeah. I'm going to dig Mary. <laughs> yeah, Ooh, no, nice. No, but yeah, you know, like, uh, but uh, here's the thing. As I was thinking, I was like, who has an incredibly complex and interesting role? And yeah, and Mary does come to mind, but but the thing is, it's it's funny. It's like, I can't imagine any of the characters yeah. played by something different, notwithstanding uh, the fact that we had a few uh, cast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In this, but it's <laughs> yeah. funny how it's one of those things, right? It's a magical thing. It's this magic thing of like, you take on, it's like, oh, you are now the character. Mm -hmm. And uh, and so, yeah, I can't imagine anybody else. I'm thinking and I'm like, yeah, what a beautiful role, but I can't imagine anybody doing this like it's you know it's liz it's her yeah, yeah, deep performance so uh yeah but i think i think that's a really great really beautiful uh, role but yeah but they're all really the writing the writing is love yeah, the definitely. writing is is incredible and so everyone has really something so finds their challenge and yeah. find this matthew is a really mm -hmm. of course there's really too many cool. isn't there yeah, well, there everyone. is there is yeah, there is you know? yeah. and like paras the way he does it it's so unique you know it's so nuanced and it's so cool it's such a different perspective and outlook and it's so fun to play with you remember like the fir the first few seasons of like wow this energy <laughs> yeah yeah, yeah. What, what is what am i you know so it's um yeah yeah, so, yeah, yeah. and Season three finished with kind of your character, Shahar, crying in the arms of Jesus. Mm. And we saw Andrew going through so many emotions in season three. And for our viewers watching, I think mm. everyone can relate to the different storylines. And it is mm. incredible writing that everyone can watch and kind of relate to one of the characters. But what's it what's it been like having to act that? And even just for viewers' response from the storylines. Mm. And it must be amazing to hear what people have to say when they watch. Oh, I mean, that is a gift on both sides, being able to bring it to life because that's what we want as actors. We want to be diving into the human condition and, and making sure that we're sort of wrestling with the complex realities of life. And even there at the very end of the season, you know, watching Simon um, come back into the boat and realizing as Andrew, like, I wasn't there for you at all. I didn't even know this was happening. And so to follow that journey, it, I think that's why people respond to it because it feels like life. You see these people, the realizations and uh, the understanding that comes from it. And I just, yeah, it is a gift. Yeah, it felt so real that the whole sequence, it was an entire week we filmed that night and in this gigantic tank and the waves were real and the rain was real. And it just felt we were kind of hours and hours and hours all night in the boat and this kind of group effort, you know, I remember a coming into the boat and you and John literally like you know like uh Eva Van Hof kind of vibes you know yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> moving everything is kind of like a receiving you and moving and everything like a like a movement piece you know and so um so yeah it's 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 a it's a kind of it's such a group effort and everybody's involved in it everyone's engaged in it and uh yeah it felt incredibly real and I would say easy to play because it's just, you know, it's all there. The rain, Definitely. everything, it's all there. You know? Well, we're so excited to see what season four has in store. So we thank you so much. We are excited too, you know, we yeah. watched the two, first you. two episodes. We're excited to Ready watch to the, the rest, rest of it. Of it. <laughs> ah, yes. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you.